we have to begin to understand something. We have to understand that humans are not our problem. So keep this in your mind. For each human, they are either going to be influenced by a spirit of God or a spirit of a demon. So, when you know that a person is being controlled by a demon, why in the world would you fight the person? If the person is the puppet and the puppeteer, the person that is controlling the puppet is a demon, why would you take your aggression out on the puppet? Let's say that the puppet gets on your nerves and then you kill it. Okay, what is the puppeteer going to do? Find another puppet, find another human. So that means that you are going to have problems with another person. So if you want to stop the attacks, you don't fight the puppet. You fight the puppeteer, not the puppet. It makes no sense to argue or fight or fuss with humans. If the puppeteer of that puppet is a demon, you fight against the demon. How? With prayers? Going on a spiritual fast? Where you are not eating or drinking anything? and reading your Bible, doing things of God. This is how you fight back against the puppeteer, that demon. Fighting against a puppet is foolish. You are going to lose and that other person is going to lose. So in truth, now you have become the puppet of that demonic puppeteer. So now, that demon is not only controlling that human, but you as well. Stop being a puppet. If anything, be a puppet for God. But you don't fight a puppet. You attack the puppeteer, that demon. So I pray that this makes sense. God bless you.